to get set up with the driver the same way every time. That's why I put this stick down for your ball position. Yeah. And you know that ball should go up towards the edge of your vest or something over here. Close to the shoulder, left foot. Just where you got it. Okay. Perfect. Where now, does it go on my left shoulder? The, the golf ball alignment. So if I drew a line on a, on a screen straight up, it oh, would kind of go see. right here. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Sure. So that's where you always want the driver. Okay, now what you need to have is the head um, behind back, yeah, and widen your right foot out a little bit. Good. So when your head just is tilted back or the yeah. zipper, then your spine feels like it's like this relative to the stick on the ground, right? Yep. Yeah, and that's what you want. That helps the ball go up in the air yeah. higher because you're hitting it solid, but sometimes they go low. Sometimes because you're set up with your upper body kind of over the front stick yep, yep, yep. and we want to just feel uh, yeah 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 i know you've been there before okay. right yeah all you're right. all yeah there you go so now you're just leaning behind the ball a little bit all the right. upper body much better Ooh. now the height doubled really right, right. so you got your ball position. got my ball position and you got your head position my head position leaning back it's okay. like easy. Yeah, it's easy now it's like what do we do to get the ball to go a little bit straighter mm -hmm. would be something we do with our our twisting of our arms a little coming through so oh. like you need to do a little bit of that I'm probably staying that way yeah right you're now. very quiet with the hands coming through okay. just get them activated you know kind of rolling over yep okay. but while you're doing that do it take it back a little bit and I'm okay. just going to keep you back here now now send the club towards me this way yeah yeah so when you're this far through you want to see that club face, you know, not straight, not here. Got it. Yeah. yeah. So everybody thinks, you know, it's like, okay, if I have the club. I the ball and that's the end of Yeah, I mean, well, it's like, if the club face is straight there, then it's probably going to come back straight and the ball goes straight. Uh -huh. Well, that's good luck, right? It's like yeah, yeah. Okay. the club's moving and different, aiming in different places all the time as soon as you start taking it away. So we don't have to think about that. What well, we need to think about it from here through the hitting zone. Okay. You need to keep your head back and that tilt. Okay. Yep. And throw the club through uh, and manually operate a little bit of that roll yeah, yeah. That. that's the new deal for you to help I square it. that's level three stuff but you know yeah so you've got like uh, yeah, okay so i got the stick there yep you got that side of the stick this side of the stick yep. the work you're going to do with this is yep. all on this side okay too late over there all right okay you got to get it over here and just go oh okay i gotta okay. really just right. okay. so you don't that's what you're doing there you're, you don't have to twist your eyes <laughs> yeah. All right. There you go. So just like steering wheel or okay. yeah, that. So head head back behind oh, a little bit. No, one. There she goes. Good setup there. Whoa. Okay, now look at the direction of the ball. Yes. Very good. Ball positions forward. Heads leaning back. Got a little bit of that head back that way, spine thing. Okay. Then you're doing some work here with the club face. And there we go. Well, it's really just going up high. Well, what would you say about that? That's okay. That's not I really mean, right. Where was it going? Left. Uh, that's called straight. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. But why does Janet have the ball position way back in her stance towards the right foot? I don't know. You're going to have to talk to her about that. Say that again. Okay, why don't you and Janet switch spots? Hi, Janet. I got that one on film. Now, you got your tee. Put it directly in line with the white stick. So put the tee right here. Okay. This is like how to set up 101 for new students. Okay. And good, good driving of the golf ball. So that's the ball position stick. I mean, the left foot is where the ball position kind of lines up. And the, like Bambi said over there, what is that? What do you mean? You know, it's like, well, if I drew a line up from this golf ball right up through you, mm -hmm. it would be right in line with this. Okay. So the edge of your vest, tank top strap, something there towards the left side of yep. you. Yeah. Okay, cool. Now, uh, for driver, go ahead and just put your club and set up with your hands right there. You need to have your head behind the green stick on a tilt this way a little bit, leaning. So that's called, just like this, not your hips, but like this. Check it out. Okay. Just a little lean. Okay, so your head is going to be 
not in line with the ball. It's going to be tilted behind the ball about four inches or so. Yeah. That's what you want to do when you set up every time. So you got the ball up by your left foot. You've got your head. Yeah. So you don't need to lean that way. You just kind of sit normal and then you just tilt, tilt it a little five degrees off the center of the body, right? Okay. Instead of being straight stacked up like yoga or something, you got a little tilt to this side. There you go. And you go about your business. Here we go. Okay. Hey, you got this? Got this. Okay. That's what we're talking about. What is this? I want her to dip that chest down underneath this thing. Just like that. The thing, you know, I mean, straight as, straight as a string. Straight as could be. Straight as could be. You know, and, um, you know, you're a tall girl, so it's not as easy to get into that hitting position. Is that right? Okay. Uh-huh, yeah. So you, you, yeah, yeah. So yeah, there's more margin for error. Well, all. you're up, you're up here, and when, when we're hitting, we're, we want to yeah, get yeah. that bend in there. So what you're doing really well, I think what really clicked was uh, the feeling, uh, the the idea that this needed yeah. to go. So now it looks like you're wound up, and now you're you're letting yourself kind of almost dip down into the shot. Right. Yeah. And I can see your shoulders moving down and rotating. Because, yeah, because I have the idea that it, I need to get under it more. There you go. Since since you go to the driving range over at the other place that has those white tees in the match, you can use that to your advantage, you know, and just practice on getting that darn rubber tee because it doesn't go anywhere. Yeah. And it's really good target practice. It's really what we're doing. We're try We're targeting that ball to hit. So if you had more reps, you know, like in the backyard, if you had a just a little mat from like a, you get it on Amazon or whatever and get one of those tees and don't hit balls. You just sit there and set up with maybe a club or a stick down and do the work as how you're supposed to set up, right? And then you just hit the rubber tee or hit the hit the target, you know? So if that tee is not moving, we're not going to probably do as best as we could. And if we're whiffing the tee, the more you did that target practice away from here, it'd be that much easier. Hey everybody, what's happening? It's Gormanator here. I just want to let you know that I'm doing live Zoom lessons. The next best thing to an in-person lesson, a live Zoom. So if you want to kick that slice to the curb, hop in and let's get going. I've got my launch monitor and the tools I need. If you're at the office, work, wherever, we can get it done. Click the link down below, hit the page. It'll tell you all about the lesson and how it works. You'll be excited to get it done because I'll take care of you. See you guys on the next video.